Welcome everyone to this short tutorial on how to install Knime, which is somehow an ETL software to um, extract data, read data, change data, and uh, put data somewhere, so treat data correctly. Knime is open source software, and I've now I've downloaded the installer for the 64-bit version, and you can see it here on Knime. It's open for innovation and um, looks pretty cool. So let's go to the installer itself. It's now loading. Take some time here, which is a pretty damn big file with one gigabyte. But uh, the biggest advantage of NIME is that it has a really rich GUI and you can embed some R processes in it. So it is a full stack of analytical computation in it using R scripts. So this is now here the um, yeah, installation process itself. Which is quite lame. So yeah, hello and welcome. I totally accept the agreement and I would like to install it in the given folder and yeah I like some start menu folder entry uh, but I don't like the desktop icons so this is installation quite simple of course and I will now uh, pause the video see you soon we are now at the middle of uh, the installation process and at the moment I'm installing here the R installation, it seems like that. So um, what I'm doing here is uh, install R a NIME with all possible plugins and uh, extensions which came here from the NIME website. Just press on download now, then you have to you know, submit your, your credentials and um, then you can choose here some downloads and I've taken here the 9 plus all free extensions for Windows uh, which is available in 32-bit and 64-bit. If you're running on Linux systems there's also an installer here as well as for Mac OS so let's see how it performs. Yeah, I'll pause the video again. After some seconds, we are now finished with the NOM installation itself, and um, let's click or oh, let's launch the analytics platform here. So um, it's firing up, and it will probably start in the NOM workbench. So it's the first time for me as well uh, that I'm um, using NOM here. And the workbench enables you to create processes and uh, put together some functionality on your data. So where's my workplace? That looks fine. So um, yeah, I'm not pressing here as a default because it could be that there are some productive and uh, maybe some experimental applications I'm trying to build. And therefore I would like to choose two different workspaces. So my system is a little bit lame, I'm sorry for that. But there we are. So we have extensions for R, for MATLAB, for Python, for nearly everything, I think. And this is the workbench here now. And um, you will have some access to databases and file operations, so you can open up here at the file reader but it's still loading I think so there are a lot of extensions um, added to the repository at the moment and um, yeah thank you very much for watching on the installation of NIME on Windows